Welcome to this walkthrough of Oxford International Digital Institute's Spotlight Test. Spotlight is a fully online English language level indicator. Spotlight provides a quick and accurate assessment of your English language ability. Now, you will have been provided with your login details via email, so go to learn.oidigitalinstitute.com and enter the same email address you used to register your account along with the password that you have been provided. If this is the first time you have logged in, you will be asked to create a new password. Please use this password going forwards. Once you arrive at the homepage, you will find your profile details in the top right hand corner, where you can edit your personal details. In the middle of the page, you will be able to see your spotlight test. You can also find the test if you hover over My Courses, or by going to the navigation bar on the left. When ready, click on Spotlight to enter the test. Make sure you read through the first section labelled Welcome. This will give you the details on the Spotlight test. There's also some useful information on how the test works, which you should familiarise yourself with to give yourself the best possible chance at showing your language level. This test will assess you on your grammar, vocabulary, reading and listening skills through an adaptive method. As you complete sections of the test, the questions will get easier or harder as you progress, depending on how many you have answered correctly in each section. It is important that you familiarise yourself with the test rules and make sure you check the device specifications before you start. Moving into the setup section, you'll find instructions on installing the Safe Exam browser. The Safe Exam browser is a lockdown browser for taking the test. This adds a level of security to the test and prevents the use of other applications on the computer during your assessment. This must be downloaded and installed in order to take the assessment. Once you click on the link, it will automatically download. Once downloaded, open the installer file and follow the instructions to install the Safe Exam browser. Agree to the license terms and conditions and click install. Once installed, go back to the test. Under setup, you can also find a walkthrough guide to taking the test. Make sure you familiarise yourself with this so that you don't spend time worrying about how the test works when taking the test. Finally, when you're ready to start Spotlight, go to the final section and click on Spotlight test. Once selected, you should have the option to download configuration. Once selected, a configuration file will download. Once downloaded, open it and the Safe Exam Browser will automatically open. At this point, you'll have to log in again with your credentials. Please note that once the Safe Exam Browser is open, you will no longer be able to open any other applications, so make sure you know your email address and password for your account before getting to this point. Now, once you've logged in, navigate to the Spotlight test again and select Attempt Quiz Now. Once you click on this, you will not be able to return, so make sure you are ready to take the test. There is webcam validation enabled on the test, which must be accepted for security purposes, so tick I agree with the validation process to continue. Once ready, select Start Attempt to start the test you'll see the progress on the test as well as the webcam validation. The timer on the right side is the overall time left for the test, and the timer in the middle is the remaining time to complete this track and all of its sections. When you have answered all the questions on the page, click Next. This will take you to the next section of the track. Once you have completed all sections of the track, the bottom of the final section will say Submit Track Instead. If you run out of time on the track, your responses will be automatically submitted. Once your answers have been submitted, the following track will open for you and the questions will be adapted to your previous answers and results. The questions will become easier with a low score, harder with a high score, or remain at the same difficulty if you answer some right and some wrong. Lower and higher levels may differ on the amount of time to complete, so please be aware of how much time you have left. 
In each track, you will have three sections, listening, reading, and then grammar and vocab. You can see which section you are on, highlighted at the bottom. Under navigation, you can also see your overall progress on the test. The green border shows your current track, the white tiles haven't been completed, and when they are grey, the track has been completed. After you have reached the end of the test and have submitted your final track, the test will end and you can click back to course to return to the course page.